Uh, not, I don't think too much needs to be said from, from my end other than, you know, just, just keep doing what we've done all year that's given us success and, and, and have fun with it, you know. Don't, don't get over anxious, don't get over excited. Uh, just go out there and play your game and, and, and let everything uh, take care of itself. You are obviously part, you are obviously part of some sh uh, Sharks Kings physical battles. What, what, what's the approach in terms of physicality to take against San Jose? Well, I, I think uh, no matter who the opponent is, 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 is you want to you wanna be physical, especially the way that we're built, you know. Uh, we got some big forwards that can get in there on the forecheck, and uh, you know we're also a team that plays with a lot of speed. And uh, uh, you know, playing against them last year in the playoffs, you know that they're a team that's not going to be too intimidated by it, and they're not going to back down from it. And uh, but uh, you know, our mindset is is to is to try to bring that that physicality uh, you know to this round. So. Uh, we're going to do whatever we need to do in order to, to win hockey games. And if, uh, if winning the physical battle is one of them to, 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 to win the series, that's, that's something that we're going to have to step up and do. Ten minutes, say to be too amped up. You know, you've got the crowd cheering the minute you come on the ice for the warm-ups and everything. Is it a little? You have to dial it down just a little bit, and it's like business is or not. Well. Uh, I mean, you, you have to try and dial it down a little bit, but it's it's almost inevitable, right? I mean, uh, first playoff game in Edmonton in, in since 2006, and you know, first playoff game for a lot of guys on uh, in this room, and uh, I, I think it's it's uh, it's inevitable that the that the nerves are going to be there, and and it's going to be ramped up, and it's just. Uh, kind of doing what you can to get past those first 10 minutes and doing what you can to get yourself uh, physically and emotionally involved in the game and where you can kind of calm yourself down. So whether that's uh, blocking a shot or, or getting in on the forecheck or even putting a shot on net, you know, doing what you need to do to, you know, get those jitters and those, like you said, those first 10 minute nerves out. So, uh, it's it's like I said yesterday. It's even going into uh, my ninth year in the playoffs. You still kind of get that feeling, so it never really goes away. But you you got to do what you can to get into it as as early as you can. Well, then, Connor is no stranger to big stages and big moments. From everything you've seen in him this year, the way he handles different things, do you think he's as prepped for a first NHL playoff game as anybody can be? I mean, he's kind of used to this. Yeah, for sure, and he's been used to it, for, like you said, from a from a very young age. I think the spotlight's been on him since he's been, you know, 13, 14 years old. So uh, the one thing that I'm I've been really impressed by is is the fact that he just goes out there and kind of blocks all the the outside stuff and and, and just goes out there and, and plays hockey. And I think uh, it's nothing new for him going into a series knowing that he's going to be a marked man. Uh, I think. Everyone expects that from 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 whoever the opponent is that that he's going to be marked and uh, and and the pressure is going to be on him to to perform. But he's always, from what I've seen this year and what I've seen uh, in the past and and even in 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 the OHL playoffs, he's able to step up step step his game up when it, when it matters the most. And I think even another example was was the way he was able to elevate his game. In, in the World Cup where it was a best on best tournament. And uh, I mean, him and that whole team kind of took that tournament by storm. So, uh, you know, I expect him to bring his best, uh, you know, but we can't just count on him. It's a, it's a team game and, you know, no one's ever won it all just by themselves. So we need everyone to step up their, their game heading into tonight. So, sir, if you're already asked,